Hello and welcome back in my reading corner. Thank you so much for joining me again for yet another unboxing. As you can, might uh, notice if you're not new to my channel, I'm testing out a new setup and I would really like your opinion on if this makes sense for you at all. Testing it out, let's see where it goes. So if you're new to my channel, hi, my name is Cece and I do mostly bookish subscription box unboxings. And today we're here to unbox the Magic Chest. The Magic Chest is a German book box, but it's uh, it includes an English speaking book so it is for the English speaking community um, but it, it might be a really good option for the European market due to shipping costs. So as I said um, this is shipping from Germany it costs 29.99 euros and I added shipping to um, several locations translated that into like your currency and you can see on the screen right now what this box would cost you. The Magic Chest is a fantasy box. It's always themed, it always has a hardcover, and depending on where you look, there's two different places. One is, I believe, the FAQ, and one is like another area. It's either three to six or five to seven bookish goodies. And it states that these should be mostly exclusive items, which is awesome. So let's see what's in here this month. So we have the Love Yourself, um, that's the September theme, and artwork. And what I really like is how they do the spoiler card. This is a really low cost, easy thing to do if you are starting out a book box, you don't have that much money to pay for like designs and um, like expensive prints. This is a low cost, but really pretty looking solution. So this is a, it's a personalized letter. It says, Dear Connie, because I order these boxes under like different names, CC, Connie, Cornelia, whatever. Yeah, the only thing is I would prefer if it would print in bold the names of the items so I can find quicker what I'm grabbing from the box. So this tells you a little bit about the theme. Uh, the theme of the month is Love Yourself. We want to give you the opportunity to take a break from your daily life and treat yourself with a bookish night, snuggled up in your favorite blanket. Bilbo, Alice and many others will be joining you on your adventure to self-love, which is an awesome theme. So it's a candle, okay. So it comes with this little uh, glass stand. Oh, it's not completely broken. It's just loose. And then there's a few things down here. And yeah, this is it. I don't know if you can actually see what it's supposed to be. But it smells nice. I like the smell. So this is like a letter. And sadly, the first item comes fairly at the end. Um, it says, similarly, um, Bilbo Baggins shows us that home is not only a cozy fireplace, but people, smells, tastes and memories that can help us remember who we are, how far we've come and what great things we can achieve in the future. The exclusive cupcake-shaped candle by Vida Spirit doesn't only look tasty, it's also full of calming scents like sage, bergamot and cedar to help you unwind after a stressful day. It really does taste really nice and I uh, it's interesting that it's like on this glass thing this is it's a really neat idea I didn't really get that this is supposed to be a cupcake so if my cupcakes look like that I don't know if I would eat them all right but um, let's put it up here all right so the next item is again in a bubble wrap this is Remus Lupin Balm and Honey. Uh, when you struggle, remember that you have loved ones who care for you and will help you in times of need. Um, Remus Lupin only started embracing who and what he was when his friends walked the road of life beside him. Remember that you never have to fight alone, even if you might feel lonely. Enjoy a bath with our exclusive Remus Lupin bath salt by Chest of Fandoms. That is a really nice scent. I am actually going to use that. So that's cool. I am liking this. Okay, what else do we have? We have a pin. I'm not a fan of pin. I never know what to do with pins. If you have use for them, let me know what you do with like all these pins. It says, never forget what you are. It's a nice quote still. It is, still is a pin. 
Uh, to accept yourself and love who you are isn't always easy, but Tyrion of House Lannister taught many of us, including Jon Snow, that embracing yourself can give you strength. You need to win times, get tough, never forget what you are is a powerful quote. Take that advice and strength with you whenever, you, wherever you go with our exclusive button. I believe this is almost it. We have a bookmark. How long is forever? Sometimes just one second um, on this side and on the other side it has the love yourself print so it doesn't feel like an item but it's listed as an item. Uh, first there's Alice who tells you how precious your time can be with a quote designed by our magic chess team. With your new Alice inspired bookmark you'll find the heart of the box, the book. All right so these four things are the items. I'm not as disappointed as last couple of times, but honestly, I, I count this as an item. I count this as an item. I do have trouble counting both of these as an item. This is a very, um, like, the back is the theme of the month, and it seems like this should be an add-on that's not counted as an item. Um, it's nice, nothing to complain about it, but it's not really, it doesn't feel like an item. And same goes for buttons and pins. Like if they are not like super special quality, like enamel pins or something, this doesn't do it for me at all. So I only feel like we have two proper items here. And then we get to uh, the book and we do have a um, book plate and uh, the book of the month is Twice Dead. Let's look at her naked. Oh, that's actually quite nice. This time it's Twice Dead by Caitlin Seal. Seal doesn't only tell a compelling and adventurous story about a girl who has to learn how to accept herself, she also sends us a signed sticker which you can stick in. Yeah, okay, we got that. So it seems like Naya is a girl who's on a trading mission for her merchant father, but then she is murdered. Um, but she doesn't enter the afterlife, but she lives again as a wrath. Naya thinks um, because she's now a wrath, there's nothing left to live for. But then she gets like visited by this ambassador and she learns that her father, um, father's trade wasn't just goods, but also secrets, um, that he was a spy of some sort. And he's claiming that um, this like guy is raising an army of the undead to attack their home country. Um, she doesn't really want to be rejected by her father, so she agrees to turn a spy herself. But before she can really um, like uncover anything, she pretty much needs to um, first learn what it means to be an undead person or wrath or whatever. So interesting, different, seems like a nice read for um, the colder times. So let's see how quickly I get to it. I am quite liking this pick. It's different to what I'm reading usually. So um, next month's theme is myths and monsters. I will see how quickly I can cancel because this is not cutting it for me. I want to cancel as soon as possible. Let's see. So let's do quick ratings. I really want to do them a lot quicker. Beauty gets four out of five points. Being special gets two out of five points. Unique selling point gets three out of five points. Service gets three out of five points. And worth, well, for the worth, again, please let me know what you think the this box would be worth in your perspective. The candle, the bath salt, the button, um, the and the bookmark, and the book. I get to a worth rating of 0 0.85, which is not enough to get a point, so worth is 1 out of 5 points. This gives us a total of 13 out of 25 points, which is a 2.5 star rating. This is not good enough for me. I would love to support um, this uh, German-European book box further, but it's just not cutting it for me. Let me know your thoughts. I would really like to know what you think. What do you think of this setup? Does it make sense to you? Um, does it like make sense for the unboxings. Please, before you leave, hit that subscribe button, give this video a thumbs up and make sure to check out my monthly giveaway. I host a giveaway every month where I put in all the items that I'm not um, using myself in a nice giveaway for you to win. So make sure to check that out. Until then, bye!